So you're going through uh, the success of the gym. You're right. going around the corner. You're going through the failure of the gym. You're going through the cleanup from the gym in terms of relationships and in terms mm-hmm. of your, mm-hmm. your your life and your connection. You start to kind of build and, and, and look at it now as, as, a, as a part of your life retrospectively. Right. Do you do it again? 100%. Woo, love that. Yeah. 100%. 100%. Why? Um, I wouldn't be prepared for anything right now that I that I feel like I'm prepared for, which is everything. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think it's prepared me for for whatever life can bring towards me, uh, good or bad. Um, I dealt with the bad. Uh, it's not that scary. It's not that scary. And it's over. It, you can overcome it. Uh, and you have... And when you really dive into any kind of business and I I keep coming back to relationships, but the relationships you build on the way doing that are so valuable. Um, I'm not, not just speaking from a a selfish point of view, but the idea that, you know, you have the ability to add value to other people and you understand what it can add value to other people. Um, you know, from a, from any perspective, I think, I think that I, I would do it again, like in a heartbeat, just, just because of the relationships and just because of the, um, the learning experience from it where you, you build a lot of grit. And I think that's, uh, as an entrepreneur, there's a different kind of level of grit than you could ever, you could uh, experience than, uh, as an employer ever, uh, just because you own it and you, you care about it. Like you own it. Like I said, you know, when, when I lost the gym, it was, it felt like, you know, like you're losing a loved one almost, uh, it, you not to, not to, not to speak, like, but uh, it is like your baby. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So, um, yes, hundred percent do it again. 